This is Steve Carrington, Palmer Mayor, taking you five days into the future for our July 11th, 2023 Palmer City Council meeting. Uh, July is that time of year when uh, there should be two openings on the Palmer City Council. And if you're interested in running, you have to be a resident of Palmer, but you can go to City Hall and talk to the clerk and the clerk's office and get a packet and uh, probably download, download one online as well. Also coming up July 21st is uh, Celebrate Palmer. We're from 3 to 7 that day during Friday Fling, but also then over at the Palmer Depot we'll be having some grilling some hot dogs, having some family activities, kids games. Uh, there's even uh, talk of bubbles and a return of the very popular noodle shoot from the Soroma Kai group should be there as well. Sidewalk chalk, etc. And we'll be handing out uh, Business of the Year, Citizen of the Year, and uh, Beautification Awards as well. We also have an opening on our Planning and Zoning Commission, PNZ. And uh, if you'd like, if you're a resident of Palmer and want to consider serving on that, go to palmerak.org and look up uh, PNZ or Planning and Zoning. You can read about, look at some of the minutes of previous meetings and uh, even find an application online and submit that. And we've got, uh, saw a letter come in from the State Department of uh, Community and Regional Affairs about how to do the paperwork to get $5 million from the state for our Palmer Library. So we'll be working on that. Also had some meetings with, uh, we've chosen Gary Wolf as our architect to work with us on that. So we'll be having some community meetings coming up here soon in the next few months to uh, look at the state of the current library and what, what ideas we have for the future. In the meeting agenda highlights, we've got uh, two public hearings. One is about the library bond where we're putting a $10 million or up to $10 million bond for the voters to vote on towards the Palmer Library. And that's one of those ones that Palmer's been very good about. If we ask for a bond and it gets approved, we only use as much as we think we need. But we just wanted to make sure that we have option and choices to do whatever we have to do for the Palmer Library. Uh, uh, there's a resolution for uh, receiving grant money for the Palmer Police. Uh, it's kind of a pass-through for DUI events. Uh, there's three action memorandum. One is an SRO officer for Colony Middle and High School. Um, that'll be working with uh, Palmer Police. And I believe about three-quarters of the funding should be coming from the school district um, for that. And at the end of the meeting, we've got an executive session to review our... Uh, city attorney we've got the council has only three employees that really actually work for the council and that's the city manager the city clerk and the city attorney so once once a year we try to have a meeting where we talk with them about what what they're working on and how they're doing and what we can do to improve so this has been steve carrington palmer mayor taking you five days into the future for july 11th palmer city council meeting mm -hmm.